So I can tell you as a cancer survivor myself, any cancer diagnosis affects your life. It changes it, and it'll never be the same as it was before. The message of hope, though, is that it doesn't always have to be worse. It can actually be better. Um, what I find for me after my melanoma diagnosis is that the flowers smell fresher, um, flowers smell more fragrant, um, things are, are more real, um, taking joy in my kids and what they do. Um, just small things in life become a lot more important in the rat race that we get tied into um, doesn't seem as important. And so with a brain tumor diagnosis, it's the same. Most people that I take care of get hit by a diagnosis out of the blue. It's like a crossing the street and getting hit by a Mack truck. Um, some people do have symptoms that go on for weeks and months and even years before, but the vast majority of folks, they were minding their own business and it came out of the blue and they had a seizure or they had a headache or they had something else that, that, that came into it. And usually what I see is that first part of treatment is a roller coaster. Um, they come in, usually into the emergency room, sometimes by their primary care doc. They get a scan, they get told they have a mass in their brain and you need surgery on your head. Um, and it's a terrifying experience and people just don't know the right questions to ask, um, where to go, who to talk to. I think in terms of how people feel and the changes that they have, one of the difficulties in the brain is that it's a really eloquent organ. There's a lot of really important territories. And if they get pushed on, if they get um, inflammation or swelling, pressure, people can have lots of different symptoms. They can have memory difficulties. They can have movement difficulties, um, difficulties understanding or expressing themselves. But these are not seen in everybody, and many people don't have a lot of symptoms um, after surgery and, and thinking about and planning for treatment going forward. But everybody's changed, um, families are changed too, and I would argue that that's true with a cancer diagnosis no matter what type it is and where the tumor's located.